Hey guys, what's up? Freestyle OMG here, back with my best friend! What's your name? Shree, cause that's my name! Uh, oh, yes. I love it when you do that. That's just so funny. So the texture pack we're going to take a look at today is called the Modern HD Pack. What resolution is this texture pack, Shree? Um, it's like... <laughs> it's like a, you don't even know what it is. Wait, okay, so what is it? 64 by 64. What's the update version 1.4.7 and they have an option for a download of 1.5 yeah. <laughs> so are you guys ready to go in there and check it out i am oh good she's ready let's go <laughs> okay guys take a look at your armor meter health meter food meter and experience meter and then we're going to take a look at the inventory. Here is the survival inventory and the creative inventory. Oh my goodness. I don't really like it too much, to be honest. I don't know. I don't, I don't really like it. What do you guys think? Do you guys like this? I don't know. I'm not a big fan of this setup. I don't like it. Now! Okay. Back into survival. Let's take this pumpkin and go. Uh, so the inside isn't changed, but the outside and the icon are changed. Now let's check out the sun and the moon all right so i want to just kind of show you guys something i noticed something as i was testing this out so let's go into creative here and fly up see there's one thing i don't like about this texture pack and i think it's just i don't know see look did you see that it just kind of flashed as soon as the sun got a little higher i don't really like that because look here we're going to look at the morning and then as soon as it goes to midday or, you know, up a little bit, it just kind of, the whole screen flickers and that's what comes up. It's just like a picture. And I don't really like it because the night is the same way. Check this out. Okay, so we're, we're just about to go down tonight. That's what happens. When it comes up, it flashes into that picture. And then when it comes down, it, it flashes into this again. And then when it gets dark enough, boom, that's what happens. See, and I don't like how it doesn't mix very well, but I do like this because I think this is really, really pretty. I think it's just really, really nice, but I wanted to point that out. And now let's take a look at our rain and snow. So here is the snow and the rain. Do it, do it, do it. All right, now let's take a look at the enchanted sword. And unfortunately, a lot of the stuff isn't actually finished. So, you know, we're just gonna skip that part. And let's take a look at, uh, let's see, I don't know if it's possible to change the fireworks. Is it possible to change the fireworks? Because, you know, we kind of only ever really see the, you know, the, 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 the normal ones that we always see. Maybe it's just not possible to change them. That one just doesn't show up. Okay, on with the review. No, not the rain and snow. We already saw that part. All right, so here we've got the fire and the lava, the water. Ooh, that's kind of cool, the particles. The lily pad. The boat. Hi, guys. Hi. I love you. Yes, I do it. And then we've got the wool textures. The building blocks. The building blocks of life in Minecraft. And then we got all the ores. Glowstone and redstone lamp. Yes. More building blocks with TNT. All of the steps. The walls, a squeaky little bat somewhere. Cute, cute, cute. I love the bats. And then we got the fences with the gate. Oh, and it looks like some angel food cake, which I don't really like, but it tastes good. But it just, you know, it just, there's no substance. There's nothing in it. It's like hollow. And then we've got, ooh, that's, yeah, I like the water particles. That's kind of cool. So we got the cauldron, the large chest, the, oh, the inventory is knocked down. Okay, enter chest, small chest, the work table. And you know what? I'm just going to assume that all of the inventories have not been changed. So we got the furnaces. And then we've got the bookshelves with the enchanting table. And we're going to look just to be sure. Yep. Okay. I figured. It's quite a bit of stuff not finished. It says that it's 90% finished on the website. But I think it's a little more than 90% to be honest. But I don't know how they actually judge the whole percentage to be honest. So here we go. We've got the note block. And the jukebox, which is actually pretty cool. I like that. And then over here, we've got the dispenser, the bed, the beacon. And we'll take a look in that just to get, yeah, see, that's kind of what I thought. I'm just going to take a stab at it and say none of the inventories are finished. Then we got glass pane and the iron bars. Pretty cool. We got the fence. That's not a fence. That's a ladder. I mean, if you turn it sideways, it would look like a fence, but it's not a fence. 
We've got the brew stands with and without bottles. All the torches. Inactive redstone dust. Active redstone dust. The redstone repeaters. And then we've got the pistons, the switches, and the buttons. The command block. And we're going to test out our breaking animation. But I'm guessing it's not finished. Oh my goodness, it is finished. Well, shut my mouth. One, two, three, four, five. I like that. That's pretty cool. I mean, I know a lot of people probably don't like that, but I do. I think it's really nice. And then we've got the trap door, the wood doors, and the iron doors. Very nice. You know what? This might actually just be a builder's texture pack. That might be what it is. But yeah, I don't know. We'll see the rest of this. We've got the stocks, the farmland, the vines, all the crops, the sugarcane, the cactus, the tall grass, dead bush, the fern. The flowers, mushrooms, and nether farts. <laughs> I just said nether farts. <laughs> nether farts. Right there. And we've got all the tree stuff. Uh, I'm not sure I really like those. Eey. Or the pink inside. Oh my goodness. Uh. And then we've got all the slabs. And all of the anvils. With all of the carts. And all of the rails. <laughs> It was kind of weird. <laughs> so let's check out the items and armor. And oh my goodness, he's got a big smiley face on his face. But it doesn't really look like any of the armors are changed. That's not good. Well, I'm sure it's a work in progress. But we got the items and the armor icons, which don't actually look changed either. And here's the eggs. Not too much change there. Potions and the poisons, not changed also. I don't think anything in this room has changed really. Hmm. There's some more items. There's a flower. Well, the flower's changed. I'm not sure about the flower pot. I think that's changed too, but I could be wrong about that. Here's the food items. And these dies. And the records, which none of them really look changed. But the pictures are changed, I think, so let's go ahead in there. Here's the art gallery, and oh my goodness, I love that painting. It's abstract, brilliant. I love abstract paintings. Awesome. Nice. Oh, that's a computer screen, look. I love these pictures, they're so awesome. Love them. They... They all look very modern. They all have that nice modern touch to them. All right, awesome. Moving on. Okay, worked. Oh, uh, don't tell me the mobs aren't finished. Oh, uh, if they are, it's minor, minor, minor changes, and I can't tell if they're done or not. Cannot tell. What the dude? This texture pack is not ninety percent finished. What is this? What the doot? Oh my goodness, are you... What? What? Oh man. Oh no. What about you guys? What the doot? <laughs> oh no! Well, maybe we caught this texture pack in the... You know what? This I'm guessing this is a builder's texture pack. Alright, so it's going to get a builder's rating from me. Let's check these guys to make sure. Yeah. Yeah, pissed off puppies? Yeah. Well, let's check out the bubble meter then, because I'm pretty sure the squid are not finished. That oh, Okay. You know what? I am guessing that this is a builder's texture pack, and for a builder's texture pack, it is actually quite nice. I think so. Yes. Oh. So should I even bother checking the, the go? The, okay. I pretty much figured. Into the biomes we go. And let's take a look at the jungle biome. It's very green. Lots of nice colors there. Blends very well too. And then we, oh my goodness, it's purple! We got a purple mushroom, mushroom biome. Or mushroom biome, or whatever. And then we got a taiga biome. Looks very drab, very much like winter. Oh, this looks very clean. Very spruced up. Nice. And here we have the swampy biome. Looks very swampy. The vines give it that sort of dirty look to it, I think. 
And here we have the forest. Very green, very nice. Love the flower. And then we got the biome, or the, sorry, the biome. The ocean biome. Nice big ocean. It's blue. I love it. And then here we have the modern village. I like the grains. I think the grain looks really cool. Everything else looks nice too. And then we have the plains biome with the grassy plains and the icy plains. Both of them very sharp. And then we have the mountainous biome or extreme mountains biome or whatever. Here it is. Very nice. Let's continue forward. Okay, let's check out the library stronghold, the stronghold library. And then over here, I kind of sound a little disappointed, don't I? I, I don't know. I, overall, I think I'm a little disappointed with this texture pack. I was expecting some something better, but I, I don't know. This guy really kind of wrecks it for me, to be honest. I don't know. What? I don't know. We'll just we'll finish this texture pack review and see what I think. We've got the stronghold with the Ed portal. And then we've got, what is this thing? The dungeon with the dudes with the box. Oh, that's scary. It's like some sort of 70s TV show icon thing I'm a doot. And then we've got the TNT boom room. If the explosions are changed, I might give this a better rating. Son of a doot. I can't believe it. So over here, we've got the mine shaft. See, that looks really nice. Very nice. And then, what is this called? Oh yeah, the Cave of Wonders. The Cave of Wonders. Very nice, very nice, very nice. See, and it, it does have some nice colors and nice textures to it. So I don't know, this one's gonna be a tough one to rate guys. I don't know. So here's the nether. Here is the nether portal. And over here, we've got the wither skeletons. I'm gonna take a stab in the dark at it. Yeah, they're pretty much what I figured. The wither skeleton is not changed. What about the wither? No, no, wither? No, oh, no, it's not done. Oh, well guys, let's get in there and give this texture pack a final personal rating. Let's go, you ready? Let's go! Oh, shree. Oh. Look, look at it all. Hey. <laughs> Put it down, shit. I like it. T you like the texture pack? I like the end. I like, yeah, I like the end too. I like some of the texture pack, but not all of the texture pack. So come here, you. Come stand right in front of my face so I can see. Wait, what's going on here? There we go. We need a personal rating. Come here. All right. Hey, what to do, Shree? Back up. <laughs> Back at Shree. Okay, stay right there. All right, Shree, tell me what your personal rating of this texture pack is. My personal rating is a 7.0. All right. Well, I kind of changed my mind a few times looking at this texture pack. And I'm going to give this texture pack a uh, 7. I like some of the textures, but there's some unfinished stuff. And this guy just, I don't know, took a lot of points off, I think. So, anyways, if you guys like the texture pack, everything you need for the texture pack is down in the description of the video. We love ya. And we hope you're having an awesome day! Thanks so much for watching! I'm inside Shree's face right now. <laughs> <laughs>